Hi everyone, my name is Chris Scarlett. I'm a certified SolidWorks professional with 14 years of experience teaching to college students and utilizing various CAD programs, including AutoCAD, Revit Architecture, and SolidWorks. I also provide design and prototyping services and training using SolidWorks for various clients in the area, plus enjoy working on my own design projects. Now I expect that you will find my tutorials to be as effective, instructive, and packed full of information as my online lectures are. Now what you will learn from this tutorial is a re-examination of the application of various options associated with some of our commonly used modeling methods in SOLIDWORKS associated with sketching, creation of features, and mates and assemblies. These options are frequently added to SOLIDWORKS over the years of enhancements, and some of them are just plain overlooked. By going beyond the basics, you will gain the knowledge on how, when, and where to apply these options to your own projects. Along the way, I will also share with you some of my favorite tips and tricks that help make modeling in SOLIDWORKS easier to understand and use. I'm excited to work with digital tutors and share this tutorial on modeling from the beginning, rethinking some of our options associated with sketching, features, and assemblies. Sign in or sign up and let's get started.